Thank you, Mrs. Fleischer. We're gonna go ahead and pull that presentation up. Um, as we shared at our August meeting, each meeting, both discussion and regular meeting, we will be doing a presentation to the board on various topics related to school district um, functions. So our first one is LIBO United. Um, last year, as many of you may know, you learned that this is a working group that we initiated in the fall of last year related to our work in the area of equity and inclusion. Here you'll see our mission and our vision. Our mission, mission is that the Mount Lebanon School District is committed to providing a safe and inclusive and welcoming school environment that <coughs> recognizes and celebrates the diverse identities within our community so everyone feels a sense of belonging. We are dedicated to providing equitable resources, staff professional learning, and support to ensure students and staff from all backgrounds, identities, or abilities reach their full potential and pursue their unique talents. In terms of vision, we see a future where every student, family, faculty, and staff member feels at home in Mount Lebanon. Mount Lebanon School District seeks to build a lasting legacy of community where diversity naturally thrives and flourishes in our schools through inclusivity, belonging, and accessibility. We currently have 21 staff members from across the district and 14 students in grades five through 12. And we are looking for students and staff to join LIBO United. This voluntary group works to move the district forward by giving students and staff the power to ensure a more equitable and inclusive district. Signups are through September the 16th. Um, we had students that graduated last year and we have been able to replace them with the same number of students who graduated plus some, which is really exciting. In terms of our meeting dates, um, our next meeting date is September the 17th. It's virtual from 345 to 445. The future meetings will be held monthly, will include, include subcommittee meetings in addition to monthly group meetings, and will be set for the year at the first meeting based on availability of com committee members. And then in terms of LIBO United scheduled updates to the board, we have one this month, we'll have another one in November, another one in March, and then one in May to finish out our school year. And then our subcommittee goals that we have been working on are related to developing a comprehensive professional development plan for all staff to support district culture, equity, and inclusion. Ensuring all stakeholders feel safe, supported, and included as valued members of the school community. And then the third goal, utilize culturally responsive and inclusive curriculum and instructional strategies for all students. Just to kind of talk a little bit about the start of the year trainings related to culture and safety, this year at the start of the school year, all staff received Title IX training and legal updates. They received an overview of district safety expectations. They learned about threat assessment and situational awareness. And they also received training on ALICE, which is our um, training related to student safety in the event of an emergency, student and staff um, safety in the event of an emergency. Administration received threat assessment training, um, national incident management system training on the introduction to incident command systems for schools, Title IX training and legal updates specific to administrators, as well as um, training on st providing students with support. And then student services received a review of threat assessments and suicide prevention, an overview of the child line process, how to identify and provide student support, gaggle and go guardian implementation to protect students from cyberbullying and other areas that are related to um, the internet and, and using, uh, this, using the internet, and then the necessity for confidentiality when talking about student situations. That is our update. We are really excited about our meeting next week on the 17th. We imagine that we'll get a few more people sign up between now and next week. And when we get together again in November for an update, we'll have um, information related to our work during the first quarter of the school year. And that's my update. 